and there's some crazy artificial bird in here <laughs> it probably makes everybody relax I am here at the Icon Siam which I think per definition is already the coolest mall in Bangkok and the last time that I showed you this Napa Light Terrace was closed so I would like to show you how they cut and the views here are just spectacular I mean if you are in Bangkok and if you have the possibility you should come and have a look here it's very easy to get here with the gold BTS line at the moment and just look at this I think I made a video one time in the evening but during the day the view is uh, is absolutely spectacular you have the whole river in front here there in the middle you have the Mahana Khan tower that we did a live stream last week And here in front, you have the promenade where you get the fountains in the evening. And here, you find the biggest Starbucks in Bangkok. So I will go and have a little check there later as well. You know, Chris from Retired Working For You made a video there. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to give an update about that one as well. And then after that, I'm going to show you the market, like the floating market, you could almost say that you have downstairs here in the basement. Yeah, here they have the infinity forest now which is a multimedia thing. So let's have a look. Okay, let me bring you guys to the Starbucks. I'm not gonna drink coffee to be really honest. I mean, Starbucks is not really my thing. I'm not a coffee drinker, but I think the interior design is amazing. So let's have a look there. Up. Yeah, here inside you have the waterfall and from here you cannot see it really well but if you're downstairs they uh, they can project the names of the sponsors and with all the different colors which is uh, pretty cool this is a convention center as well with a big convention hall Yeah, I think Icon Siam, they established themselves as a, a very special mall. I mean, you know that there's a lot of malls in Bangkok, but I think Icon Siam did a, a good job in doing something different. So here you have the Starbucks. Yeah, I will just have a quick run through it. It's funny, there's quite a few people in Bangkok that are really into all the Starbucks designs. As I said, I am not a big coffee drinker, so for me it doesn't mean that much.
But this looks pretty cool. This is very similar actually to, to the design that you see in the Apple Store near Central World. So I don't know if it has to do with the same designer. Let's have a check upstairs. Of course you have stunning views from here. And there's some crazy artificial bird in here. <laughs> it probably makes everybody relax. Sorry, huh? Okay, I will see you guys downstairs. So the Starbucks is on the seventh floor and here on the sixth floor you have the Hobbs House of Beers and I can recommend going there and have a drink and just enjoy the views. So here the sixth floor you have a lot of uh, nice restaurants. So I thought it would be a nice idea to give you guys a little tour they created a kind of forest atmosphere here where here in the middle you have a big waterfall here to the right there on the top you have the Starbucks Yeah, I think it's pretty cool how they created this here. You have all these little niches and little corners where you can eat. Different restaurants. I like all these little features that they have here. You know, they try to create a kind of nature atmosphere in the middle of, uh, of the concrete jungle. Okay, so here we are at the front of the mall. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this update regarding the nice views on the seventh floor and um, Starbucks cafe and then the sixth floor restaurant area. So if you did, feel free to subscribe, press the like button, leave me a nice comment and see you guys in my next uh, video.